country. Everywhere in Abilene, the eye is greeted by one name and one face, Ike's. Through Kansas, toward Abilene, a train carries the candidate and his wife, and it stations all along. Meanwhile, Abilene, Kansas, Ike's home. The general's train pulls in, and it continues most of the day. Ike and Mrs. Eisenhower, nevertheless, are greeted by an immense throng. Ike's running just behind Senator Taft in the race for convention delegates, but there don't seem to be many Taft supporters in a parade is staged in his honor. And Eisenhower seems to be entertained by the scenes reenacted from his own boyhood in Abilene. But he warns Mrs. Eisenhower not to believe everything she sees. Town, where he is to make the opening speech of his drive, is in a flurry of preparation for the biggest day in its history. Confers with Senators Duff and Lodge and Paul Hoffman, his chief of civilian clothes, General or Mr. Eisenhower.